We are live. Let me refresh. Make sure we are good. Nothing yet. All right. We're good to go. So a little update. Still kind of congested, still kind of bothering me up here. Breathing out of my mouth a lot, like Eli Manning. And so I'm just, it's just very tough, but we'll get through this live show. We'll knock this bad boy out. We're ready. Uh, let me see who's here. Eric, um, Jose, Jimmy Patel, and uh, Panda Rose, William Perry, One Kick Finder, Dapper Fanatic, Resell Freak, Brian. Brian, how was sourcing today? Uh, let's see. Brian Todd Fines, Manny Fresh, Debe, Anna E. Milko, and Kevin, Rudwin, Abnett. Uh, Swoopman, Max, Big Money Mo, uh, Stevie D, The Plug, A End, Kaiser, James, Magnetic Souls, Kevin, my boy Miles, uh, let's see, Nick, what's up, Hey Hustle Fam, Edward, uh, Brown Town Finds, catching, catching the show from work, Paola is also here, Fast Eddie. Brian, sourcing sucked today. The whole crew was at Bassett. So we have one store where all the resellers go at once. <laughs> Why? I, Is it a big store? Uh, it's the main one that I guess uh, restocks in the morning right when they open. Oh. And so instead of everybody kind of spreading out and risking it, they all go to that one store and see and each other fight. and you stare fight. each other down. Yeah. Uh, Mile High Hustle, Xavier, Funky Finds, Sonia. Uh, let me see. Most Closet. Are you going to ever get an HD camera like Ken? Deborah Fanatic. <laughs> Man, that's what we're going to start off the show. All right. Uh, Eric watches YouTube. James, Josh Leva, Thrift and Flip, Puma Hustler. The tension must be real at that store. <laughs> Uh, L.A. Dad. All right, more people coming in. Uh, some news, some finds. Let's go through it. Let's start off with this. Did you, uh, did I hit? No. Did you doodle enough with your app to get access to this? No, I didn't even know. <laughs> Anybody in the chat fiddle around with their app to get enough attention to hit on these? Hmm. Let me see in the chat and see what they say. Uh, the Mile High says, nope. L's every day. Josh Leva. Uh, Momo Dog, what's up? Uh, <laughs> like, watched, shared, and nothing. Uh, three L's, LA Dad. Nope, says Frog. I got none. Big Money Mo? Doesn't sound right. Uh, the people that are hitting have zero activity. That's weird. First time in the live chat, Alexander, appreciate that. Thanks for the content. Thanks for watching. Uh, it's a hit on my account that I never click anything. Eric watches YouTube. Well, congrats. At least you were able to get one. But that's weird because they want you to mess around with stuff. Hmm. Uh, let me see. Sonia, yes. Fragments. Travis Scott, do what you can. Diver Fanatic 3Ls. People with no activity getting W, says Omar. So this thing was just a whole sham. They just want you to watch stories and things you don't want to see, stuff about Virgil, just to yeah. try to get this. To give you yeah. some yellow Air Force ones. Yeah. Well, congrats to everybody who did hit. Let's see what the other ones come out. And starting to the updates. And if you case you wanted to see what Adidas is doing, this <laughs> is what they're up to. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Uh, how much for you to rock these? How much to pay you to take an IG photo with them on? Bro, I wouldn't even touch. Uh, about 10 grand. I'm cheap. <laughs> 10 grand? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Josh, leave it. No way. That's legit. Well, apparently, uh, retail tag 250 Yeah. <laughs> 10 grand dude i'd rock it for an hour 10 grand 
So e I I. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> Puma Hustler. <laughs> Uh, Adidas doesn't know what they're doing anymore. Adidas can go bankrupt now. Straight horsing around at that yeah, price horse. to the gym. <laughs> Dude, he has a nose, too. I didn't even recognize him. Uh, like, yeah. What the that? Yeah, nose, mouth, eyes, hair. Adidas about to get canceled. Stuff of nightmares. Let's see. Nike got dunks. Adidas got donkeys. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is that man. what it's inspired? Who's Curving Frost? Um, I looked it up. It's um, I think it's like a guy. He's like a entertainer or a comedian or something. I don't even really know. <laughs> Anybody yeah. else give us some in insight in the chat? Fiona looks better than this. <laughs> uh, let's see, <laughs> Kermit the Frog, <laughs> Mr. Eric. Uh, let's see. Anybody else say anything in the chat? Yeah, this is this is hideous. Uh, next. I'd rock it for free, but how do you keep the hair clean? <laughs> uh, all right. We got official photos of the Jordan 12 oh utility. <laughs> how many more, like, black Jordan 12s are we going to get? I, I think it's a clean shoe. Uh, black, bright, crimson, white color scheme, grind outsole, 3% Nike grind, $200. Comes out uh, in 10 days. Like Recycle material bottom, yeah, three percent. I'd pay a hundred for this when they go back wall plus 20 plus 30. Yeah, 100. I'll be a good winner, shoe, Mr. Eric. I'm tired of Jordans. Wow, I, I can't, I can't hate that comment. I mean, so many different colors, the same models, Jordan brand milking it. Mm -hmm. Let me see. So many robberies gonna happen wearing this shoe. <laughs> Big money mall. Uh, more sad horn, please. Uh, we're not even done. The next one's another sad horn. Uh, let me see. The hood loves twelves retrospective gear. Uh, those fire for collecting. Next, if in case you want to see what Adidas is up to, this is what they're up to. Dude, it's like a rip off three. Uh, what was that? What was the other Yeezy? Uh, was it 700? Uh, what's the other one that has the black onyx? <laughs> well, it's pretty much just like a Yeezy without the uh, right thing called whatever that is on there. I <laughs> uh, just put human race right there on the side, yeah, get some laces. I mean, come oh, on, the 380, yeah, it does look like a 380. <laughs> it's like uh, wearing socks on top of socks. Yeah, Pharrell, I'm really disappointed in this. Yeah. I mean, I don't really expect more. That guy's whack. <laughs> I, mean, like, I mean, like, you're supposed to take your career to the next level. Like, this one is like, what in the world? I'm going backwards. I'd pull so. a Kyrie. I don't have anything to do with this. <laughs> <laughs> you just pull, I just pull out of it completely. I didn't even design this shoe. They're just yeah, exactly. wearing it with my name on it. Exactly. <laughs> this thing's trash. Having it trash. Pharrell went downhill. Not even DD's worthy. All right. Into the news. Uh, anybody in Texas, uh, Spring, Texas, did you go to this new Ross? I think it just you opened up. pillows. <laughs> but yeah, did you buy pillows? <laughs> Uh, it opened up, it looks like already two and a half weeks ago, maybe two weeks ago, but did you go to the store or the opening? I want to know. Let's see, pillows, <laughs> Mr. Eric. Also in the news, USPS plans temporary price increases for holiday season. Similar to like what they did in uh, 2020. It would start October 3rd and continue through Christmas. So keep in mind, service will not be uh, better. They will not do better for you. They're just going to increase prices and slow things down. So what's that for us? We're probably going to be at 10 cents, at 25 cents, probably. Or So it's probably. Well, we're, not, we're not shipping anything 11 to 20 pounds. Right. So we're probably, yeah, the zero to 10, so it'd be 
25 cents or 75 cents it's been yeah 75 cents all right everybody raise your prices to 75 cents so you're gonna stop crying and complaining about it so you'll be ready for the zone but also keep in mind they said first class will now take i think like eight to ten business days or something that's why we don't sell anything first class <laughs> so of course oh many fresh two dollars oh, cool. hd 4k webcam oh i like that yeah glenn's gonna find something in mercari <laughs> and see what i get uh let me see we go back up i forgot to drop off usps today mr eric uh let's see they're gonna lose packages again probably yeah they're not guaranteeing this is gonna increase productivity no nope. they're just increasing prices show more more money yeah uh let me see switching to ups again for the holidays dapper fanatic oh always that's like uh that's a must uh let's see padded envelope yeah true padded envelope you're doing uh, see, look, you're 75, 75 cent increase. Yeah, flat that's rate a, uh, boxes and envelopes. Yeah, that's gonna really hurt my business. <laughs> <laughs> Two bucks, Dabber Fanatic, man, super man, cheap. Man, four dollars for your HD camera now. The four dollars towards the camera. Uh huh. They they want to see. They want to see some skin. All right, let me uh, go to the next. Oh yeah, how are your sales? B. Man, I haven't even checked what i've checked out man i've like i thought i told myself we're gonna chill in august it's my this birthday. birthday month yeah birthday month this boy chilling yeah. uh oh better it's better compared better. to last month better than last month just like a slow amazing mr eric terrible pt hunter well um, it's see. yeah overall it's terrible because i haven't done anything but my ASP is went up to 140. Yeah, see, higher in products. Higher, yeah, higher in products. That's, <laughs> yeah, that's very surprising. Uh, I've sold more dunks in the last two weeks than compared to last month. They love so, the dunks. Yeah. And I just keep raising the prices. <laughs> Let's see. What up, guys? Armand, eBay on fire. Mr. Eric ASP at $120.60 to be exact. Mm, he knows nice. his numbers. Let me see. Sales on fire, fire, goat booming. This week was down, up the last 30. Goat good, eBay slow, listings way down, crazy sales. Amazon, eBay, and goat. eBay's been steady, goat non existent. So, uh, going back to uh, last thing on this, on those Kobe's. Okay. Uh, legend continues. So remember how uh, the guy shipped off like a, a small ass box, so it got right. denied without indication. So the guy sends me a message uh, yesterday. He says, "Hey, bro, what do you know? The shoes came back. If you're still interested, hit me up. Here's the number." <laughs> 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 well, wow. so did you text him? <laughs> did you text him? This freaking guy, just a big waste, like a whole month wasting trying to get Kobe's from this dude. If you don't want to sell them, just tell me you don't want to sell them. It's all came down just to post it. Don't tell Mercari. Don't post it, Mercari. <laughs> all right, let's go to next. Oh, weekend releases. Uh, this is today. Yeah, I didn't even try. I forgot. <laughs> uh, Dunk Low Sale Multi Camo 110. Man. Um, is anybody getting tired of Dunks? People getting tired of Jordans? Are they getting tired of Dunks? Yeah, I think. Yeah, it's. Yeah, I'll, I'll see them on somebody's foot this weekend. Somebody will rock these. L, yeah. Josh Leva. More Dunks. Oh, yeah, that was Nike Dunk so Korean. Only on Sneakers Korea. Oh, anyway. I know. Come on, man. What's going on here? <laughs> 110. 
which is not even going to be here. So what are we doing with this? Next, Journal One High Seafoam, August 13th, sneakers and Foot Locker. That's uh, women's, right? Or men's? Yeah. Uh, oh, I think this is women's, I think. Yeah. Do you care for the seafoam? In the chat, B, do you care for the seafoam? I think it's all right. Not bad. I mean, it depends on the quality it comes out because it's a women's shoe. They're going to always get something shoe. weird. Yeah, I guess let's see. Uh, clean. Uh, Cop for Sneakers Pass Reservation. Uh, let me see. Clean. Mr. Eric says no. Seafoams are limited here, it seems. Armand. Uh, let's see how well they do. I don't know. I really like the laces, but everything else looks good. Yeah. What kind of lace, uh, laces you can uh, yeah, change that out. Yeah. And of course, August 13th, be ready for your L's. For people running bots, getting a ton of them. Who knows what's going to happen? But 150. Uh, Fragment Travis Scott. Mm -hmm. See Travis Scott Friday. Yep, Friday the thirteenth. Be ready, ready for my L, Josh Leva. Quick L, instant L. We're ready for that. Keep going. Perfect time. Messi just left Barcelona. Barcelona. <laughs> yeah, let's release the shoes. <laughs> yeah, this one also just sneakers EU. August fourteenth, one hundred bucks. So, what do you guys think about Messi leaving? It sounds like he didn't have a choice after being there for 20 or 21 seasons. Yeah, 21 seasons. Yeah, they fi they finally uh, they finally opened their books and saw the profitability. <laughs> that, <laughs> it wasn't too profitable keeping Messi any longer. <laughs> and then now he's going to be wearing that Jumpman on yeah. his jersey. I wish he would switch to Nike or Jumpman, though. Man, what the heck? I mean, you know, you're switching teams. Drop. I mean, do and Neymar left, so Nike has some space. Neymar out there with Puma. Um, finally the PSG jackets that I've been holding on. You like time to cash out, baby. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> but no, he even said that he offered half of salary, and I Google his salary. I was like, man, half, even half is, like, a lot. And then now he got, what, I think he was making, like, two-something, 200-something million a year. Yeah. And then he offered half. It was, like, 100 million a year. And then now he signed for, like, 85 million a year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at least it's PSG, though. I mean, at the end of the day. Uh, let's see. Mr. Eric says, don't forget, guys, PSG still a Vero on eBay. Is it still a Vero? Or I thought they fixed it. Did they fix it or not? I don't know. I don't think eBay even knows if they... The, it was a Vero? <laughs> yeah, I don't think eBay even knows what's going on there. Yeah. Uh, um, We might have to uh, do our research on that one. Uh, anybody get anything taken down of PSG recently? Right. How about last that in the chat? jerseys jackets anything psg did it get uh taken down ebay is clueless says mr eric all right now let's see what they say jordan one high pollen that hustle here we go. colorway here we go where's my horn uh august 14th saturday 170 uh, to legit says nope. Sold a jersey last month, no issues. Yeah. I got Viroed on Arsenal. It says vintage profit. Uh, hmm. Let me see. PT Hunters also says no. Interesting. My PSG stuff still up, but no international shipping. Dapper fanatic. Oh, that's probably why. It's probably oh, okay. international. And if you do international. Try only doing GSP. You might be able to get away with it. Jordan One High Pollen, are you going to get a pair for yourself? Oh, sure. I'll probably keep a couple. Oh, just, one to just, rock, one to stock. Just in case I want to rock the B custom or something like that. <laughs> I'm never wearing it. <laughs> <laughs> the B custom. It'd be good for the back. Nah, very true. Yeah, but especially over here. Oh, you're a Pittsburgh fan? Nah, trash. <laughs> 
Uh, Wu Tang, and you'll see the Steelers jerseys, the Pirates jerseys, the Penguins jerseys, the Wu Tang shirts. They'll all be ready uh, just for these shoes. Let's see what they resell for. Any predictions? No. Two. Mm -hmm. I'd say it'd be two thirty, two fifty. Okay. Uh, considering that the quality looks good, um, it's just sure, it's a three ten. No, <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think it'd go up. What two seventy? Too high. Yeah, considering all our stores are getting them. Mm, okay. So this like shadow. Out there. I think it's shadows number. So oh, you. Oh man, how... that's not good. <laughs> yeah, it's not good at all. Yeah, this oh, is man. full family, by the way, right? Uh, I believe so. Full, my, full family. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Eric, okay, fine, 250. Is a black leather pebbled? I believe so. It looks like it yeah. is. Yeah. Uh, where are they coming up with these numbers? <laughs> Big money mo. Uh, Mr. Eric passing. <laughs> now it changed. <laughs> Everyone's all hyped with the DJ horn. And now, I'm going to leave it behind. After uh, all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, bit, right. B right. talked me out of it, so no, that, that's why that's why I'm like, you know, I'm kinda like confident like I'll get a few pairs because I don't think it's gonna be crazy high. And then, you know, my wife wants one. She wants to, you know, have a black and yellow just for the hustle B brand, but that's pretty much it. Uh let me see. Some finish lines here hasn't got and footlocker so two seventy, I say, says Richard. All right. Power rankings last week. Ross number one by default. Burlington and a slightly over Nike. And then I think we switched it at the end. Marshall's at one. Now, Marshall's still at one. Oh and <laughs> 189. They went down to yellow tag. What were they before? Like at two fifty or something? Yeah, something like that. They're yeah. the uh, golden goose. Yeah, even though they're all, I mean, you know, they're supposed to be looking. They're supposed to look all trash. But yeah, yeah, like they're all trash, and the uppers lace are like frayed. You see, they're like <laughs> tied tied together. Yeah, but but I mean, considering they retail for like four ninety nine, five ninety nine, so you know, somebody that wants to. Ball looking like a bum. <laughs> it go, man. That's like the ultimate. Just um, one backwards, huh? Yeah. It's like, like all right, all right, right. So the richer I get, should I just get up like a beat up car now? <laughs> that has brand new wheels and rims. <laughs> like, cause the bottoms are clean. That's the only clean thing about this thing. Yep. You yeah. get all this wear and tear on here. Next thing you know, you get ungluing. Hey, I didn't think ungluing was part of this thing. Yeah. So it's falling apart. Yeah. So they get you. So 189 went down. Toyota B Land Cruiser. Yeah. That's my that's my uh dream one of my dream SUV. And oh, we also got Project Rock, 60 bucks, TJ Maxx, retail 135, flipping for funds. Also found this jacket out there. I remember this one a while back. Kind of a hard to sell too, I guess, because the design well, is kind of. I I think that came with the uh, the Muay Thai shorts, right? If oh I'm... yeah, I think so. Yeah, and then you can rock the pollen once with it. Yeah. There we go. You can rock that. Has the stinger. <laughs> Watch out for the stinger. Uh, let's see. Oh, Burlington at two. <laughs> wow. Part full of Iversons. Wait. This is Jake's wet dream. Loves the Iversons. Would you have paid fifty nine for them? Uh, these are men's, right? Is this a Harden? Harden, and then this is the uh, what was that one again? The trash Reebok. <laughs> uh, I forgot what they called this one. I know. I remember, I remember seeing it though at Foot Locker, one of those. But would you pay sixty for them? I think the Iverson one is, I mean, the Harden one is selling good. I don't believe that one is, I think. Mm. <laughs> Dominion. I, uh, are, uh, for real? Is it for real Dominion's collab? I think it is. 
Minions collab. Uh, I've been finding these things. Let me see. Hard flood on those. They're oh. giving first 100. <laughs> Maybe you got to learn today. Oh, no. Well, free fair. <laughs> Wait, then. There's a reason why Hustler Hacks didn't include them in a the video. Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, let me see. Let me go back up. Reebok shoes looking like a power line from the <laughs> goofy movie. What the heck's going on here? That card is tragic. Mile high hustle. <laughs> Wow. I found those today, Gambino. A cart full of trash for miles, and everybody just going deep. <laughs> We're just trying to have a good old happy show. I know, Man. like finally somebody get a cart full, and then it gets roasted. <laughs> everybody just going hard in the paint. So, man. <laughs> uh, let's go to the next one. More Iversons. Oh, Man. no. Burlington is empty. My Burlington sucks. Mr. Eric, there's a reason why I don't sell and go to Burlington. This is one of the reasons why. <laughs> Maximum 2300. Leva. Chai sticker deals. Clams kicks. You know what? We're going to get less people tagging on stuff. <laughs> they don't want to get roasted on the show. <laughs> it turned into like, oh, yeah, feature the finds to now like, oh, man. Hey, hey, hey. To begin with, though, tag the good finds though we didn't say tag the trash finds <laughs> they just dumped all the iverson to burlington huh vintage profit for sure burlington has been terrible says miles uh three of those minions sold hustle crow what so there you go sold for how much <laughs> now he's asking questions that's how we learn trap all bundy true very true you yeah, see there's mm -hmm. no mistakes here let me see. That just means my Reebok will bring out new stock. Mr. Eric. Let's see. Next. More. <laughs> Iversons. Try to stick your deals. <laughs> Iverson doing a live signing next week at Burlington. <laughs> hey, it's about, the third, it's about the third 50. He's about to get his money. That's very true. Reebok owes him quite a bit. We're going to cash out. Real Deal Thrifter, bunch of Ohio State Buckeyes, uh, Nike hoodies, and zip-ups. And we are done. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Nike Factory Store, big money mo. Now, hey, I'm would you rock like, this? I know. I'm usually doing like, yo, don't yoke me up. Like, no, this one now. No. Dude, I look like the Michelin man. <laughs> And then rock my uh, utility twelves. <laughs> utility twelves on feet with this bad boy. So oh, um, wow! I think it'd be hilarious to get the biggest size. So how right. many more? If you have like two, three X, and then just see how I did rock this. The Missy Elliott jacket for sure. Big money mo. You gotta put one on foot with a ski mask on. This one in the. You know, fall in line, Nike. He's always first in line anyway. <laughs> oh, man. Big Money Mo, Missy Elliott jumpsuit, Puff Daddy and Mace going back in the day. Oh, man. Five-star safety rating. Three <laughs> 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 yes. XL sleeping bag. <laughs> man, you, you, you laughing, but, but this is comfort. And once the uh, so when the snow hits, would you rock this though? Yeah, but I'm gonna cover my face. Oh, okay, <laughs> I, I can't let anybody see that's me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my high, I'll put my 11 and stomp on the snow. <laughs> <laughs> hey, with but, this on, I'll roll, I'll, I'll like swim in the snow. Man, yeah, we gotta see. I want to see one of these bad boys in person. So, uh, big money mo, how much were they? I probably should have looked into probably like twenty five bucks. <laughs> Next, also big money mo tech fleece twenty one dollars camo. Also got the adapt one eighty six and some high end cleats and the thirteens for kids. I like fluffy jackets. I don't know why. Uh, this is like a 
like a onesie though. This isn't even like a jacket. <laughs> it's not a jacket. It's a onesie. That's the <laughs> yeah, thing. Look, yeah, it's like a onesie. Yeah, the <laughs> zip goes goes straight down to the leg. <laughs> <laughs> There's another Vero onesie. Next, uh, sneaker flip find. Bam twenty four kick. Stay hungry and dapper fanatic. Air Max twenty seventeen. A classic. I haven't seen those in a while. Oh, wow. Those are like $300 at least. So we got them for 90 bucks. We also have Cosmic Unity and uh, Air Max Plus, LeBron's, uh, Jordan's, and more. If you have to pee, you have to completely take it off. <laughs> 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 what do you do taking a dump? Imagine you're at the store, you gotta take it down. They gotta <laughs> hang it on the door. Uh, it just gets weird. It's a drag. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can't wear that. And if it touches the toilet seat, that's like another thing. Big Money Mo, again. This time, just the jacket, just the mm -hmm. top, <laughs> like a romper. Uh, so you got a lot of those 2017 70 bucks. Big Money Mo. Trap Al Bundy. We got the Olympic singlet out here, 165. Picked it up for 56 bucks. Uh, let me see. <laughs> I cut a hole in the booty and call it a day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me see. Uh, NFL jacket, stay hungry. Sneaker flip find. Got 30% off clearance. Got some of the jackets, $36. <laughs> All right. More. Let's see, Shifter. Got some of the kids, fours, the Griffies. Oh, wow. Was that Nike? Apparently so. Oh, wow. Uh, I guess all back wall doesn't have the, the lid. Uh, Vapor Max Flying It. And uh, 90s, 270s, and more. I, I like that haul right there. I like that. Okay. Be like someone. You know what? Oh. It's a golf clap. Yeah. Be like golf, you know? Uh, light work today, Big Money Mo again. And uh, sorry, I took your name off. I don't know what happened here, but Dorn Becker, uh, Air Force One Low. Oh, wow. Uh, Oscar says, That's me, people. There we go. Oh, good job. Oh, the Dorn Becker. Dorn Becker or Shifter? <laughs> uh, be approved. Hustle Crow. All right. Now, bigger clap. Richard, not bad to start the day to only spend seventy five bucks on the Levi's. Uh, when I when I went to the next, you know, photo, mm -hmm. sold for five hundred. What? Richard, I know he's here. Yeah. So I want to hear more about this. Man, should have went to Indy. <laughs> uh, selling for five hundred to take that all day, seventy five bucks. And uh, Ross with something. So let me see. Dang, big cheese. Damn, Nick. So let's see what Richard, uh, what he has to uh, say. What he can bless us with today. All right. Next. Steph Curry's are back. Hunt collections. Uh, those are pretty cool. Harachi cleats. Slams kicks. Chamel Hunter, $25. Phantom GT. Leva out here, Black History Month jacket, $25, retail $200. Let me see, you bought two months ago, retail was almost a thousand bucks, says Richard on that Levi's jacket. Man, wild flip. All right, let's go back down. Uh, more Nike jackets, Ben Cook, Brian, Bam 24 kicks. And uh, two jackets here, Tech Pack and Camo. 180 retail, 140 retail. Some of the boots. Fry Ooh. boots. Let's see. XIO Hustling. Slim Pickens. Oh, Open that's a funds. Kohan. Kohan up top. Up left. Also Kohan and Doc Martin and Fry. All mixed in here. Boots. Ready for boot season. Uh, let me see. What was that Levi's jacket made of? Ask yeah, Nick. It looked like it was suede. 
Let me see. Are you guys posting your winter gear now or waiting? Says Double Jump. I always post. Um, unless I mean, it could be both, right, Glenn? I mean, there's really no right way to do it, but yeah. but probably maybe the better. At least you don't have to worry about that later on. At least you're yeah, ready. that's true. Uh, next, JT resells rapid find. Those are some pretty cool jackets right there. Mm. Uh, wind horse Nike basketball LeBron puffer vest. I know I I saw one of those and I wanted to buy it and I saw it was LeBron's. <laughs> so you just left it behind. You saw the yep. LeBron logo. And you're like, hey. yeah. I was like, not nah, trash. Oh, this guy. I think that's a- I think that's patches, but I think there's a LeBron logo on the back. I was like, oh, I can get rid of this. But I saw the back, there's a LeBron logo. <laughs> uh, one kick finder, double swoosh on the jacket. It has a little uh, kangaroo pouch. I know, for snacks. You know what I'm saying? When you're cold. Uh, hell yeah, be ready for that. Uh, Brian, City of Flight. Also, uh, the other Jordan jacket up in here. We also got Trap Al Bundy. Uh, 600 retail. <laughs> Is that 600 or 800? Oh, 600. So it's pretty much like a rain jacket over a jacket. Yeah. Double. So you get two jackets in one. Two in one for 25 bucks. Yeah, I think you can separate them too. Most of them you can. Let me see. Don't sleep on Columbia winter jackets for women. Mr. Eric throwing out advice. Bolos. Bolos out here. He's not even charging people. Right. Smooth sailing. What up? Uh, here's the same jackets that Burlington has been overcharging on. Twenty five dollars exactly. here at Ross. Ross cares for the people. Ross exactly. is for the people. <laughs> Ross cares for people down in Texas and California. Give them a puffer jackets. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of them. Uh, Two fifty retail, twenty five bucks. Derby City. Uh, a couple of the Adidas, Terex, and we got Nike uh, Windbreaker. Ben Cook, Polo, McLovin, Polo, and Don Alpha Cleet. That's a name we haven't heard in a while. Don oh, Alpha wow. Cleet. I think I think Don Alpha Cleet uh took my advice, just taking the few months off before he gets crazy again. Yeah, just focusing, just in the same, you know, that same mental space, just chilling. Right. Uh, right. making a nice little comeback. So mm-hmm. especially since the last time, remember everybody was just like Ah, uh, this dude's recycling old stuff. So you buy an alpha cleats. Like, you know what? Let me take a step back. Right, right. Let's right. regroup. Regroup. I'll jump back in. Yeah, he just got snacks from Pol- uh, from Ross and found polos. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Just let's see. Bolo for polo. Uh, let me see. He didn't miss anything. Saved gas. <laughs> exactly. Dan. Next. More polo. Let's see what do we got. We have Peewing jackets sold within a day. Hustle to win. We also got these uh, vests. Also got the USA KS reselling. Uh, we also got heat finds, polo championship games. Nice. And uh, up flipping, we got this uh, big Nike jacket. So, just more jackets everywhere. Funky finds T Higgins, Bengals, trash. <laughs> Bengals fans out there in the chat, all Bengals fans. How many of them are out there? Are there any? None. Uh, Sneakers that find Patriots, Vikings, and let's see, we got a USA tie dye pants, Fire Lane store. I uh, got the Uggs in there and Brian, two of the jackets. Uh, Mr. Eric says none on the <laughs> Bengals. Uh, preseason, I know Dolphins are playing, I think, Bears on Saturday. And then uh, I think Hard Knocks just started, Cowboys. Oh. So you can watch that, whoever wants to watch football stuff. Uh, do those Puma hoodies sell good? Fly kicks. This one right here. Uh, what is it called again? Kid Super Studio Studios. Oh, I don't know that. The man misinformation in hand. I'm here late. At least you're here. Uh, saw and passed all Bengals jerseys. They all had <laughs> Joe, Joey B. 
And uh, Ian says nope. <laughs> All right. Uh, more. Bengals. Justified Creations Boutique. Also, Harley Davidson Jackets. Oh, Harley. All right. Those are cool. Uh, Maximum 2300. Budweiser Jackets. What? What are they? Ma- who made them? Uh, I don't know. I don't think they have uh, a... Was there like a brand or a collab or something like that? Huh? It's kind of so. odd. Yeah, I don't odd. think so. Huh. I think I don't know. Odd. They're twenty five, maybe. Anybody see these Budweiser jackets? Hmm. Maximum twenty three hundred. And yes or no on the jackets, followed by what is your drink of choice? I want to know in the chat. Beer or non beer? What do you like to drink? Derby City Flip. Arizona. And let's see, more of the Higgins jerseys. Man, a lot of, like, college stuff. Adidas pants, different random uh, teams. Washington and more. Let me see, Abner says water, Coke, double jump. Uh, let me see, whiskey, funky finds, iced tea. One bourbon, one shot, one beer. What is uh, Jake's drink again? Jake, when we go to the casinos, he would always get um, a uh, pineapple, pineapple, pineapple with... vodka, Tito's. Yeah. <laughs> it has to be Tito's. <laughs> uh, let me see what else do we got? <laughs> Man, White Claws, Miles, Canada Dry, yeah, Zero I love Sugar. Ginger ale. I love ginger ale. Oh, Chick fil A lemonade. Yes, sir. I just had it. <laughs> I, I probably have the lemonade at least twice a week. Uh, milk from Ross. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's pretty good because uh, they're real lemonade, freshly squeezed. So I, that's where I get my vitamin C. Oh, okay. Yeah. Josh Leva. <laughs> oh, man. It's still, uh, nobody wants to try that stuff. The raw, The box milk. Any drink that's free. Next. Uh, we got Gators, Up Flipping, and the U, Buckeyes, and some pretty cool jackets, Up Flipping and Flipping for Funds. Uh, at one point, you were into Buckeyes, right? Ohio State? Yeah, uh, when they had good coaches. And good players. They still <laughs> good players, but. I don't know what happened to them. When, like, I think it, I think the money got too, like. Like the coaches were just getting paid too much, yada yada yada, and then, then there were like scandals of, you know, just random stuff. And it, it <laughs> like, especially being in Ohio, like it became like a non-football issue all the mm-hmm. time. So I was like, I was getting, I was getting annoyed, and and like, I think the last two games I went, they lost. So I was like, <laughs> oh my, God. like, like I'm out like of here, trash. I'm, spent money to get here i have to lo- walk so far to park so far and you guys lose come on come on <laughs> imagine following the dolphins for 20 years but dude um i give it to them though their halftime show is where it's at i actually get snacks during the games and everybody stay for the halftime show because of their uh their band the high state uh, band yeah okay interesting uh, yeah, these are pretty dope. Uh, Nike jackets, some 90s vibes. Uh, Project Rock, backpacks, heat finds, Bay Area Mike. Nice. Uh, let's see, catcher's gear, five bucks. Flipping for funds. I think they said five down bucks to... for those catcher's gear. Yeah. <laughs> Man. I think the backpack went down to 30 something. 35 bucks, 37 bucks, something like that. Uh, let me see. Space Jam cereal selling for money. Uh, Mr. Eric, how are things out there in the health world? And now we got Doc Martens, Rapid Finds, Wind Horse, some of the Uggs, Bam 24 Kicks. Oh, you got to rock this with that puffy onesie thing. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck's going on here? Is that is that UGG? Has to be, huh? Uh, I forgot what the brand was. They said it here in the in the, in the comments, or maybe yeah. I don't know. I forgot what it was. And the Converse Hyper Dealer sneakers. Chewbacca, the red <laughs> Chewbacca. 
Chewbacca boots. Yes, Uggs. Uh, Jordan um, backpack at Ross. Uh, let me see. Haven't been picking up those Adidas pants. Ten dollars been hard to pass up though. Try ball Bundy. More Uggs. Mile High Hustle. Oh, there's those uh, boots again. Yep. Uh, what'd you say they're called? The Tartan print. Tartan. There we go. Tartan zip plaid. Yeah. Bam 24 kicks and the wind horse. I also got a cart full in here. Doc Martens and more. So, man, less and less Nike. Uh, let me see. Oh, man, here we go. Mr. Eric's giving us her update. Closed pretty much all day yesterday. Denying any ambulance runs coming in. Still primarily the un, we don't want to say, mm -hmm. whoever tends ready to go as well. Man. We got Funky Finds with the U. Leva Tech Pack Jackets, 30 bucks. Richard, a couple of the Nike Vest and Bobby Hustle's Browns. They got 5% chance of winning the Super Bowl. You hear that? <laughs> I didn't see that. Yeah, ESPN said it. Uh, ESPN. They say a lot of things. <laughs> All <laughs> right. That's it? <laughs> That's it. <What>? <laughs> that is it. Ross, by default, still number one. Nike Factory Store, which this should be two, not three. Burlington and uh, Marshall's way too high at one. All right. Giveaway time. And you have to spell it out. How many are listed on eBay? Mm. Championship Games Jacket. I would say... Thirty-two. Okay, B's going with thirty-two. And we have a winner. That's quick. They already wow. knew. So this is rare? Uh, let me see. Let me go back up. Did we got a winner? Yes. I think I still might have. Now I might have to owe double. I think Eric watches <laughs> YouTube. Five. That's the correct answer. Five listed on eBay. Wow. Haven't seen any other polo jackets. I've been checking. I haven't seen anything else. So, all right. Let me get this out of the way. Congrats there. Man. Man. I gotta get my nose back. I gotta, <laughs> I gotta breathe. This is, uh, this is rough doing these live shows. Uh, how much are they selling for? I need that jacket. Any uh, topics? Anything we want to talk about in the chat? Life. Um, random things going on out there. It's a tough mm. world. Sourcing, selling. It's just weird because I haven't been a. Uh... A hot, hot drop that, you know, like, well, I guess that we like, you know what I'm saying? Every drop is a sellout now. True. But I, I thought I was going to be a little bit more excited and appalling than, than it is. Mm -hmm. I don't it's because there's too many Jordans. You're not as hyped yeah. anymore. Yep. That's, that's, what's, that's what's happening. Too many kicks. It's getting rough. Mm-hmm. Uh, let me see. I think, oh, Nike 50% is gone, I think, says Big Money Mom. Mm. Um, allergies, no. Did get sick, but not of, you know, that word we can't say. Um, it's just the usual thing that, that I get, but I hadn't gotten it in like a good year and a half. And then now came back, so it just got congested. That's it. No, no sore throat. Nothing else. It's just right there, and just like bothering the hell out of me right now. Summer league. Dub for your Lakers against my sons. Hmm. Who's playing <laughs> for the Lakers? <laughs> <laughs> Summer league. Uh, Rachel, what's up? Pawns are only available in my foot action of all places. That's weird. Wow. Josh Leva. Let me see. Uh, let's see another shutdown coming soon? Question mark. Possibly. I mean, if the hospitals are getting full, 
and then now like they're just coming out of like you know more restrictions you got to go to certain events you gotta be this you gotta be that so yep wild i know living some wild times i don't like it uh I'm trying to think what else that's something else i was gonna say oh yeah tomorrow's video uh top five jordan 13s oh that were downright disrespected top yeah i mean like are they good 13 so was just disrespected <laughs> or like uh, they deserve to be disrespected no they don't deserve to be disrespected they okay. were disrespected for a reason well one of them maybe but uh the okay. other ones are someone there are some really good ones in there so uh loving that series appreciate that mile high hustle uh what is your favorite jordan 13 b playoff okay I did have one, and then sadly, that was one of the shoes that I had to sell to help start this business. But I, I sold it for like four hundred. Oh man, which was good money. Yeah, I mean, of course, the bread thirteens are like the classic. That was the shoe that my dad, that my dad had, that I remember that really got me into Jordans, because mm. uh, he he know he knew somebody that would buy him Jordans all the time. This was during back in the day that where right you can just walk in the store get your jordans right so he had like he had jordan 15 or 16 and then he had the i believe the two was it 2002 that it re-released uh the retro the 13s that had the uh the reflective 3m mm -hmm, yeah that was it i still like it but I got rid of all my 13s because I feel like they were too bulky on foot. Yeah, they do look funny on, on foot. But, when, oh, well, it looks clean when you're looking at it on somebody, but when you're looking at it from the top down and the way it feels, it's like, like I feel like I'm, I'm wearing like a triangle shoe. <laughs> but they are very comfortable, though. Yeah. I give it to it. Like, yeah, they are 13s, super comfortable. Like the your ankles are like padded, the tongue's like there. You just have a giant pancake tongue though. You yeah, know, yeah, like, it just true. goes so wide. But yeah. But they are comfortable. Super comfy. Mm -hmm. uh, like, wait, wait, we got questions coming in. Uh do you think Ross and Burlington will keep increasing prices now they have started catching on? Um Who said they were raising prices? Well, I think well Burlington's going high on the jackets because the retail is also super high on that. But they've uh, been like that. Yeah, they've so been like that. They just haven't gotten this much that people actually see them. Because as far as I can remember, I've never bought any high-end jacket from Burlington because they were always like, I think 60 was the cheapest I've seen them. Yeah, we've seen Jordan ones. They've had their jackets there for like 100 bucks or mm -hmm. less. But yeah, yeah. honestly, I think everything is going to go up from here on now. We've already seen the inflation. We've already seen the free money. <laughs> We right. know nothing in this world's for free. Yeah. Gas went yeah. up. Groceries went up. I think everything's going to go up. And that's something that more. sucks. It's like, mm -hmm. uh, let me go back. There's some hospital stuff in here. Hospitals getting full. Elective surgeries are all being suspended in the hospitals. I visit for my work. I'm a rep to legit. Oh, wow. So it's giving, it's giving us the same trend as the last time. Um, yeah, I do know... Uh, my my cousin that's a nurse icu nurse to be exact all their beds are full and they're converting other uh i don't know what you call it wing mm -hmm. to be icu that are not really icu just because they're running out of room and they have their capacity so they're not taking anybody in anymore so they're having to send people away it's just turning into a big mess because, of course, they want everybody to go against each other. So, like, we're not – yeah. no one's on the same page. So, it's like, yeah, oh, I think there's misinformation and this I isn't right. That, and, yeah, I think there's something, an agenda that – try. I mean, at the end of the day, when there's chaos and there's war, right, there's, there's somebody benefiting from it financially. And I think we've seen that so much. And sad to say – 
greed just takes over, man. Oh, man. Let's just get through this. You know what? Let's just get a smooth fall into winter season. Watch football. Great sales. Ship things out. That's what I, I like. know. I mean, I was, like, waiting for, like, a real Christmas again. Yeah. You know, like, I, I was, I'm, to be honest, I'm the one that loves going out, like, during, like, this holiday chaos. Because, like, that's where you truly see people, like, I, I feel like I see a lot of people kind of, like, going out, doing more family stuff, which kind of, like, makes me happy. You see kids laughing and everything like that. But last year, that, that got me bad. It's like, man, like, we're not doing anything much because of, you know, like, you just have to be so careful. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of weird thinking how we're already over, like, a year and a half into this. Like, yeah. if you think about how, how fast time is going by, but at the same yeah. time, that's a year and a half of your life that's been in this mess. That Right, right. Obviously, we're not getting back, but you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. It right. just kind of sucks to to think about, but uh, let me see. Uh, people interest change too. Big money mo. Uh, we'll never get back to normal. Uh, yes, yeah, Sid- Sydney shut down. I think a week ago, something like that. So they're quick to react. So um, yeah, the vaccination mandates have uh, rolled out. Um, so some people, you know, especially in offices and stuff like that. So some people are having to make a choice. Um, I know one, like, I don't know how, how they're going to do without him. He's like one out of two of the head surgeons of some specialists here in the, in Ohio. And he just got an email that vaccination is mandatory and he he doesn't want to get it so it's like they'd have to fire me and i don't think they can fire him he's too Mm. important so now it's a matter of like who's replaceable or not but but again somebody said about causing more shortage Mm. right like that's that's weird right we're not kind of like it's like a twilight moment that yes people are imposing it but people are of course are free to choose whatever they want but now eventually they're gonna have to choose not to get that thing instead of are you gonna comply our company policy or not yeah and it's even getting messy in the nfl too oh i know i saw that (laughs) man let me see we have a doctor who refuses to believe in it uh Mind blowing. Felt bad for his patients. Once they're admitted, uh, let me see. I can't find Nacho David seats in store no more. Why nobody talking about that? Big money mo. <laughs> we already have worker shortage. It's gonna be worse. Talked to Jake lately. Is he well? I actually did talk to him today. Now that you mentioned that, he's oh, doing nice. good. I did talk to Jake today. Uh, he's doing well, and we still need to bring him on, which we can definitely do that as you know whenever whenever he wants to hop on he's always yeah. welcome here yeah yeah in on the show size 17 bro come on bro uh, let's see he's in the chat <laughs> he's <loose> uh, <laughs> all right so i guess we are done and that was kind of a quick show but at the same time and i gotta be ready for next week i want to be i hate feeling like this yeah, you know, you a small to... little part it just like destroys you when you can't even sleep right. Right, it you sucks. have to you have to hibernate soon. Yeah, I gotta just hibernate. Sleep, just drink, just drink your uh, vegetable juice. <laughs> yeah, vegetable juice. Be what do you do when you are sick in terms of shipping, Mister Eric? Um, there's only been one moment that me and my wife are sick together and it was the sea hmm. but besides that we're Did never pick it up we're never yeah yeah we had it we had it pick up yeah we could we could we could do pickups i just like to deliver it because that's the time when i get out of the house anyway yeah but besides that i could get i could get it uh uh pick up and yeah. uh we have like two good friends that 
that have always offered that they could they could uh they could pick ship for take us. It. yeah or pick up and take it and sometimes they offer to ship for us you know if we just get all the products out and it's it's simple enough the process is simple enough yeah <laughs> All right, so I'll eat some flaming hot. So I'll get your nose draining. Yeah, I have some like some Mexican chile stuff. Some like right, some strong stuff. I probably should. I should probably. Yeah, you that. might have to uh, get some like soup, some Asian hot noodle soup. <laughs> <laughs> Make you cry at the same time too. Oh man! All right, so tomorrow's video, Jordan Thirteens. Please watch that one. Friday, Ross video. Monday mindset we'll be ready and hopefully the voice the nose will be ready to go you got a few days you know we'll be ready all right then we'll see you guys go ahead and get it see ya